So several students have been wondering why I answered this question in a particular way. So this was uh, the first question in paper two in exam 2024. And here they wanted you to draw the change in the concentration of bromine with time, while the rate indicates that the rate equation indicates that the it's zero order in terms of bromine. So you would expect the graph to be a straight line with negative gradient. When you look at the marking scheme, you're going to find that it's actually going to be curved instead of being a straight line. And you would wonder why, even though it's a st uh, it's zero order. This is because experimentally that the uh, bromine would exhibit the zero order curve with being a straight line with the negative gradient only if the other reactants are in excess, which is not the case here in this question. They didn't state that the other reactants are in excess. So the concentration of bromine will change also due to the change in the concentration of the other reactant. This is why the curve would take that shape. However, if you draw it as a straight line with negative gradient, it's still going to be accepted as well.